today this lady has asked me to cleanse her energy so I thought I might film a little bit of it to show you how now as I've told you before you have an energy field and here's one way you can feel that now I'm not a professional at anything this is what I do I'm sure there's a lot of you Reiki people and healers and whatnot out there that says oh my god that woman's crazy but this is what I do and I'm showing you for your edification or amusement but you can like this is Angela's method non-professional and you can feel a person's energy and so you have to practice it sometimes but then you can start getting a feel of it and this right here she's really spongy right here she's not but anyway to cleanse her energy I'm just going to kind of take my hands and I'm going to literally break when I feel things and if you practice you will and now some places in her actually I'm going to do a healing on her too because I'm feeling places that she's got a terrible void back here and uh, she did agree for me to do this, obviously. She's got a terrible void. Now, when I feel this void where it's like there's just no energy, my hand's hot. I'm actually doing a healing now where I don't, don't ask. This is just what I do. But anyway, it, there's a void, and I'm trying to put energy into her body. I'm not trying to do anything. I'm laying my hands on her and just let happen what happens, okay? She told me earlier my hands felt hot, and what I'm trying to do is get a hold of her energy, which I have now. I'm kind of just pulling it out. And again, this is non-professional. It's just something I do, okay? I'm just telling you for your amusement and or edification, you might try this or not try this. It's not a substitute for a doctor. I'm just cleansing her energy. Anyway, I do feel that she's got stuff sticking to her. See, people touch you and whatnot throughout the day. And they, they leave their, um, what is the word, tentacles, you might say, attached to sometimes. Now these drop off naturally, you take a shower or whatever, but sometimes they don't. And we just like, cleanse, just rake it off, rake it off. And then I have to do this or it'll stick to me. <laughs> now you can imagine a bubble around you or a mirror around you and other things that you've heard me discuss on here or, you know, I will discuss if I haven't, which I'm sure I have. To help you have protection so that you know you imagine a light right here and this light gets bigger and your whole body's glowing then you're in a bubble then there's a mirror on the outside of that people look at you they see a reflection of their self rather than softening your energy they recycle their own that's a protective thing but this is also a way to like I said cleanse energy and after this I might break bad and burn a little sage around her because sage is something that's known to kind of settle energies but anyway this is one of the stranger things to some of you stranger things i do and to some of you it's some of the least strange things i do depending on how well you know me but anyway thought to share this with you today you can go ahead and hit the button now